Oh, hello, we are at the IQ Revenue Conference, which is held in the Hotel Yalta in, in Prague. And I have picked up, uh, picked out one of the participants, uh, Lenka from uh, Hotel Yalta. Lenka is the revenue manager of uh, Hotel Yalta in uh, Prague. And uh, Lenka, can I ask you a few questions regarding revenue management? Yeah, sure. Well, first of all, uh, I work here as a reservation and revenue manager. Uh, our hotel has 94 rooms, uh, which are in uh, four different categories. Uh, our hotel is not that big, which means that uh, the positions are actually shared. So I'm in charge of the reservation department as well as revenue. And it's not just me, it's also our general manager and the director of sales who make all the decisions about the rates. But you are a busy person. I am, of course I am. <laughs> uh, Lenka, if uh, you could choose one revenue management system, what would it be? Well, to be honest, at the moment I would choose rate gain because we were in touch with, uh, with you, you introduced us the product and I think that's something we really need here because uh, optimizing the rates is a time-consuming uh, activity because we do everything manually at the moment. We do not have uh, a revenue system, so we have to check manually uh, what occupancy we have, uh, at what rates our competitors sell the rooms, uh, at the, which room categories, uh, what the demand is, uh, what events, uh, events are going to take place. So uh, it's really time-consuming and we would really appreciate to have a tool which would help us uh, make the decision and also which would uh, help us with the optimization. Excellent, excellent. How many times per day do you update your rates? Well, we receive reports uh, regarding uh, the rate changes of our competitors, uh, changes in the demands every morning. So let's say in the morning we always uh, make kind of a check and then during the day we make some other changes in case uh, we know that something happened, that there are some reservations confirmed. So let's say a few times a day. Excellent, excellent. How is your pricing structure organized today? Uh, today, yes, uh, I have uh, already mentioned there are more people who make decisions uh, about the rates. Uh, we sell through different channels. Uh, of course, the, the importance of uh, the OTA segment is uh, growing and that's, that's for us, I would say, the opportunity to optimize the rates and to maximize the revenue. We also sell through wholesalers, but uh, that's not the thing that we can, you know, work with, uh, with the revenue that much. Do you see a growth potential for the OTA segment in the future for Prague? Uh, yes, I think so. In my opinion, it's, it's growing all the time. Uh, of course, we would like to maximize the, the direct bookings, of course, because the commission is not that high. But it's not just the direct booking because, I mean, we need to drive the booking to our website, which is not free of charge, of course. And I would say that we just need to optimize how much we pay for driving the business to the website so that it's not as expensive or even more expensive than the OTAs. Excellent, Lenka. Thank you very much for the short interview and have a nice Thank conference here in Prague. Thank you so Thank much. You. Bye -bye.